Here's video number two of Layla. <laughs> She's only been here for a couple days. Um, really sweet, well-adjusted gal. Um, she's eating fine, has great litter box habits, really sweet, sweet gal. Greets me at the door. She hasn't hopped in my lap yet, but she, uh, <laughs> she greets me at the door. It's kind of, kind of mellow for a young kitty, but, you know, she may find some more energy once she gets adjusted to living here or, you know, being indoors or being taken care of and adjusting to her new surroundings. She's just as pretty as she can be. Hopefully we'll get her into the vet in the next few days for her surgery, for her space surgery and exam. And I don't anticipate any problems there at all. <laughs> Sweet girl, sweet girl. She's a really soft, sweet-sounding meow. Um, she was meowing this morning when I was fixing her food. She was winding around my legs at the, when I was standing at the counter getting her food ready. Um, was that a little nip? Was that a nip? What's the matter? Am I getting... I don't know if it was or not. You didn't nip me, did you, baby? Look at those beautiful blue eyes. Look at those beautiful blue eyes. Yeah. Yeah, it's a good girl. It's a good girl. It's a good girl. So maybe she does have a bit of a tortitude. I really don't know if that was a nip or not, but um, her tail's flicking a little bit like she's a little annoyed. But What's up? What's up, pretty girl? So there she is. Such a pretty girl. Such a pretty girl. Those big ears. Get those big ears, sweet girl. Sweet girl, sweet girl. So Layla, young girl, probably around two, <clears throat> ready to go home in three weeks or so, two or three weeks. Not sure how she is with other cats. Um, I expect she'd be fine with a male, but I don't, I don't know yet. Haven't introduced her yet. Too soon. Pretty girl. That's a pretty girl. She hears Lang Langdon behind me eating. She's looking at him over there. Oh, you're just tired of being taped. You need to take a little snooze now. Okay, baby.